Hello and thanks for joining us for Comcast Newsmakers Campaign 98. This hour's newsmaker is Edward Robb Forshone, who is a candidate for the 1st Congressional District of New Jersey on the Legalize Marijuana Party. Tell me why you decided to throw your hat into the political arena and seek a seat in the Congressional District. Well, it's, it's time for the myth of marijuana to be thrown out. We need someone in office who wants to uh, change the law. Do you feel as though like your outlandish things are getting your point across or people are just looking at you in a very negative way? No. Well, I think some people do think I'm a little eccentric. Some people think I'm a, uh, uh, you know, I don't know what to call it. Some people think I'm a butthead, you know. <laughs> for you at this point, because you have run for office in the past, it's about free speech now. Yes. My, this campaign is really a protest to me and I want people to join in my protest. Uh, and basically, uh, I'm protesting the, the war on drugs. I'm protesting actually the war in Iraq, too. Oh boy, here's that troublemaker, Ed Fortune again. Also, AK no, a, known in some circles as Weed Man, okay? Yes. But in many ways, you're going to say, you know what? No, I'm, I'm your typical American patriot. In what way? Right, I am. I'm a peaceful, patriotic pothead. Um, and I truly believe in free speech and, uh, and freedom. And how can you have freedom when the government tells you what you can and cannot put into your body? Uh, you're no stranger to fighting for such things. In fact, you've gone to court many a time. You believe it's part of your religious beliefs as a Rastafarian. Yes. Now, just like Catholics use wine as a sacrament, and there's other faiths that, that, uh, that, that have sacraments, uh, in the Rastafarian faith, the use of marijuana is considered a sacrament, and I believe it should be protected uh, under under the First Amendment. Just how free 